Christmas now. Jingle bells, jingle bells. Jingle all the way. <laughs> and we switched. You see that theme switch? Did you see that? Let's get some themed dice. Let's do some Christmas dice. There you go. Now it feels like Christmas, right? <laughs> <laughs> all of that. That's all it took. All it took. All right. So now we're in our holiday binder for Christmas. And this is our money for Christmas. Let me count it real quick. And then I will open my binder. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 91, 10, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That's 90. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and you guessed it, 200. Yay! Okay, so we have $200 of stuff into this Christmas binder. We are catching up, I would say, with our, our, our holiday savings for Christmas. Um, we still have a long way to go because I'm pretty sure we are no longer traveling, which is a good thing, but now we're hosting. <laughs> We went from the lions into the fire because now we have to prepare the home, the food, all that stuff. So I'm excited. I'm super excited. Now I wish I got Taylor um, a little of it's all, a little of her, of it all, her Christmas book so I can do all the planning and I didn't. So there's that. But, um, you know, lesson learned. <laughs> Go on and prepare for the worst. Expect the best, right? Or no, Expect the best, prepare for the worst. That's what it says. That's the saying. Anywho, let's get into our holiday binder. I made all of these stickers. Aren't they cute? I love it. So I made all these little bow stickers. And then these are actually freebies, uh, minis, from our girl, Becca Budget 777 Those were freebies she had on her channel. But I made the minis into decor on my binders. And I'm going to do them, but I put my charms on them. I thought that was like the cutest thing. It looks like tags. So anyway, that's my holiday binder right now. And I am loving every bit about it. So let's go in here and see what damage we can make. Y'all, these scratch-offs are making it look so awful. But look at that. It's so awful. Anyway, anyway. So I made all the stickers in here. I thought they were super cute. And I had a lot of fun making them, to be honest. So we are we are doing this one. And it says there's some ho-ho-hos in the house. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I thought it was super funny. But if you don't find it ha funny, it's okay. I laugh for the both of us. So this is from the Craft Co. Budgets. Danny again. I love her sense of humor. Love it. You got to laugh, y'all. Find a reason to laugh in life because you can't be serious all the time. It's exhausting. It's exhausting. <laughs> so start with saving challenges that make you laugh. This, case in point. Okay, so that was $7. So let's save seven today. Do we, should we, shall we scratch again? <gasps> oh, we're supposed to start right there. Oh, wait, this is the last one, and then we're going to go back to where we're supposed to start. Let's scratch one more. Let's do this one. Another seven. So 14 now we've saved on this one. Let's stop there for now. We might come back. Okay, so let's put this 14. Let's put this back, and we're going to take two more ones and a 10. Voila. Okay, so now in our ho-ho-hos are... 10, 20, 30, nope, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So $26. And we're actually going to put these 10s back and take a 20. We're going to start consolidating that way. And we are good. We're on the board. So I'm going to stick this in between the money and hope that it doesn't stick too bad. The next, nope, that's not it. We're on this. This is where we are. So we're on this one from Nita. And um, this is our next one if we finish Nita's. And uh, right now, we probably can. We have enough money to finish this one. So Nita is from the Almost Organized Owl. She created this, and it's basically merch for church. And so we're church merch. We're saving for church merch. And so I do want this. I think we can go through for our Christmas attire um, when we go to church on Christmas Eve. So, ooh, 15. Ooh, 17. And seven, what's 24? Let's just finish this bad boy. 24 and five is 29, $29. Okay, so I think we, I think it's supposed to say 54. So, okay, let's just see, 29. Let's see, let's see, 25, one, two, three, four, 29. Okay, so now we have, blah, blah, blah. now we have, here we go. 10, no, 20, 5, 30, 5, 40, 5, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4. Perfect. So what we're going to do is take 20, 
10, 20, 30. Let's replace that with another 20 and a 10. And we're golden, y'all. That way it makes it easier to count when we do our closeouts at the end of the month. It's the end of the month. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for bringing out a song again. So we are finishing a challenge. Wait a minute. I just didn't get excited enough. Finished a challenge. Bam. We finished a challenge. Okay, so this is our next one. It's, <laughs> it's from Sarah on a budget. Or not Sarah on a budget. Sorry, Sarah from Beauty Mom Budgets. And she created this one. And it says, yep, you read it right. Scratch my balls. So, <laughs> so this is for Mr. A um, in his savings. I'm going to use this to buy his Christmas gift and or stocking stuffer. It's just $30. So we are going to have a hoot and a half doing that one, y'all. So we'll come back to that if we have more moolah. So we, in the meantime, there we go. Let's leave that so we don't forget. And we're moving on to the next one. So this is from Stuff and Budgets. It's Oh Sushi Tree. Oh Sushi Tree. So I love sushi, y'all. Do y'all love sushi? I love sushi. I love it. So that's a six. I'm going to talk in scratch. So that's a six. Um, I have my favorite. It's called Ex-Boyfriend at our sushi place that we always go to. That's 11. Let's do one more scratch. Three. So that's 14. One more. Oh, wait. That's perfect. 16, right? What is it? 11 and 5. Yes. 16. Yes. Okay. So we are, our favorite sushi place, Mr. A and I sushi place, um, is over not far from here. And we absolutely love eating it. Love it. So, um, my favorite one is called the ex-boyfriend. It has the smoked salmon on it. Oh my gosh. It's so good. With cream cheese and that spicy mayo with a little bit of eel sauce. <gasps> So good. If you're ever in the Dallas area, hit me up. One, I'll go with you because that's just another reason I get to eat it. And y'all, it will change your life. It'll change your life. If you're a naysayer on sushi, come eat with me at this place. And then I'll get you to be a whole haysayer. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. Anyway. So this is a fun sticker challenge from my girl Lemon Ivy at Lemon Ivy Budgets. And um, we are doing this. It's a cute little pink Christmas. I thought this was so adorable. Like really adorable. Little mouse. Oh, I love it. The nutcracker. Anyway, it's this very traditional pink Christmas. Can I say that traditional pink? Anyway, so this one is a bunch of tens. That's all it is. So you just color how many of our tens we're putting in. We put those stickers down. So let's put, let's put $20 in today, shall we? So we're going to put one snowman and let's do... Listen to this cute teddy bear over here. I love teddy bears. So that's twenty dollars. Um, should we do one more? Let's. Uh, yes, let's do. Well, we have all these fives. Let's take. Let's take another five. Because <laughs> this is one hundred and fifty dollars. We're gonna be doing this for a while. So let's get a little bit done. So okay, so that is good. We have thirty dollars going in here, so that works. And um, we'll call that good for now. So thank you, Lemon Ivy. That is such a pretty one. If you're looking for Christmas challenges, this is worth it. I love it. Um, and then this one, so cute. So this was a gift from Budgeting in Introvert. How adorable are these? She is selling these on her site, y'all. So go get this from her. If you want some winter, beautiful, beautiful winter. This blue is mesmerizing y'all it is so enchanting i love it anyway so these are two scratch offs so let's do the 60 dollar one shall we so and then we might do the 80 dollar one too who knows worlds are oysters so that's a nine and that's an eight which is 17 let's keep going and a six what is that? 17 6 7 a 23 and then a five so let's stop there because well i'm losing my mind um 23 plus five is 28 so let's go with that. $28. I love saying dollars like that, y'all. <laughs> I don't even know where I got it from. Someone had to have said it that way, and it just kind of resonated in my brain as a fun way to say it. So that's 25, 26, 27, 28. Perfecto. Okay, so we're on the board with that one. And we will be doing more like this one because that is just gorgeous. I want to look at like, you know how you want to look at something? I want to look at those. 
So I'm loving, I'm in love with those challenges. Great job, Budging Introvert. And she's on the Budging Introvert on Etsy, not the Budging Introvert that you'll find on YouTube. The two different people and they say it all the time. So it's the one on Etsy, she's awesome. And the one on YouTube is awesome too. I am subscribed to her channel too, but it's not the same person, just FYI. Okay, so we did this one already, so let's skip that. And then let's go over here to um, this one from Budgeting by Dina US, my girl, I love her. Um, she has these challenges and most of her challenges are double-sided, y'all. It's like a win-win, can't go wrong. So this is 110 saved and this is 45 saved. You know which one we're gonna do. <laughs> Usually I do the most, but we don't need, I can't break the bank that bad. So we might do the other side after we finish, but we're gonna do the 45 side first. How about that? So that was six. And this is nine. They're cute little gifts. I love it. So that's $15. Let's go one more time. And that's eight. So that's 23. Let's stop there. So we've made a great indention. Halfway there already. Ah. Okay, so $23. We're going to have to use these fives up, y'all. So 20 one two three perfect and we are this is the first time we're scratching this one so that is all the money we have for it so far perfect and i'm gonna split the money on this one i don't think it's gonna stick but you never know the next one y'all this is so cute so this is penguin party this is from windmill ridge miss susan i love her she's a member of my channel and y'all she comes up with the best things you know why because they're digital downloads and you can put your own stickers on it case in point i put my own stickers on this and you can print it off as many times as you want win win i love it so and her challenges are gorgeous so that's three dollars and this is going to save us 65 so these are going to be relatively small numbers because there's so many so we're at nine so far okay so now we're at 14 <laughs> um we can keep going 14 and 4 is 18. Let's try to get to 20 without going over. Oh, it's 1. So what are we at? Hold on. 10, 14, 18, 19. What's the odds of getting another 1? Let's do this one in the corner. Not good. <laughs> Not good at all. Okay, so that's 15 and 24. So we got 24. Okay, I'll clean this up after off camera. Let me just clean this up so it doesn't get everywhere. Okay, so $24, so 10, 20, and we don't have any change, so we have to take these, we only have $1 left. We might, maybe we should have just thrown the five, the five in here, made a donation, we'll see. So $24, right? 10, 15, 20, one, two, three, four. So $24 in our penguin party, so cute, so cute. Okay, so that's on the board, yay. And then this is another cookie challenge from Miss Liz and Les. I love this. We have the boo ha and the Halloween. And this cute, cute, cute Christmas one. It's Christmas cookie decorating, y'all. I love Christmas cookies. I can't wait until we get into the holiday season because I want to do something in the budgeting community um, to kind of bring us together even more because, you know, we need more togetherness, right? <laughs> Um, okay, so there are only six cookies here, but we all have all the decorations. So obviously we'll put a flower and some holly. You know, the world's your oyster. You can do whatever you'd like. So we are going to put on, we have a little bit of, we have a couple more challenges we do need to get to. So while I'm rushing through this, okay, so let's not do too much because I do want to hit everything up. We're going to do, we're going to do this 10 with this reef leafy thing to start. And then we'll put some holly and stuff on that. Yes, that's so cute. Okay, so $10 coming at you there. And we're gonna stop there for now. I want this to kind of last a little bit. So our, we are on the board with Liz and Les's Christmas cookie one. Yay, and you see my sticker? I made it, it's the baking crew. So all the challenges in here, I do want them to be about food. <laughs> just so I can look at it and appreciate. So this is my mother's Christmas song. I'm gonna read, I'm gonna sing it while I, while I uh, what's it called, scratch, scratchy scratch. Grandma got ran over by a reindeer. Coming home from Christmas, our house Christmas Eve. You can say there's no such thing as Santa, but that's for me and grandma, we believe. Is it grandma or grandpa? Hmm, I don't even know. I have to look up the little lyrics, y'all. 
I just love that song. And it makes my, it makes me remind, it reminds me of my mom who's still with me. I mean, I, she's always here with me um, at the house. So, but no, every time it just makes me think of her at Christmas because y'all, she loves that song, loves it. Okay. So we got nine plus seven is 16. So that was perfect. I wanted to stop there because we used that one. So this is on the board here. So we already have this going for us. So in total, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28. So this is from our girl, Lindsay, at Boy Mom Loves to Save. And um, it's going to save us $100. So we have a lot to scratch off here. And they're probably going to be a little spicy because we only had, what, 20-something? So we have a long ways to go on that one. So this one is Genzo for now. Yay. And it looks like we're not going to get to my last set, but that's okay. We'll start with that next time. And we're going to be doing Christmas more often because, like I said, we need this money in here because I need to spend it. So this is a $100 savings challenge from Golden Girl Budgets. I got this because it's hot cocoa. And I told y'all I love cocoa bombs. My neighbor made, I told you about the Harry Potter cocoa bombs, which were, they when they dissolved, they turned your hot chocolate the color of your house. So it's like a sorting hat. <laughs> and then... um. So my other hot chocolate that I love to take is candy cane. So I will put a can't like how this one is. So we're gonna scratch this one. Oh, yes, perfect actually, because that's all we have left. Ten Zulas. Yay! Perfect. No money left over. No IOU. Yay! So anyway, I love to make the peppermint hot chocolate and I put little peppermint pieces and I do do make my own whipped cream, y'all. I cannot stand that 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 um whipped cream that comes from a can no no judgment for those that can i just cannot stand that stuff so we have 20 dollars total in here now um so we i guess we didn't have change that day so anyway i um cannot stand the can and whipped cream in a can so i always make my own always 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 miss b's turned into she's a little spoiled by it um mr a says it's my fault of course it's my fault <laughs> of course it's my fault um so anyway, I love hot chocolate with the fresh whipped cream, peppermint stick, so I can stir it. And I, when I lick on it, it's that peppermint flavor with the mocha, the, you know, like the, I do add chocolate while I'm, I'm talking about it. So it's just, oh, so, so good. So that's my favorite way to drink hot chocolate. So do y'all have a favorite way to drink hot chocolate or y'all just Swiss Miss is good enough, <laughs> good enough for you? So let me know. But anyway, I'm going to stop rambling because I've talked a lot quickly. So I don't even know if there's any part of that I can edit out besides um, saying, sorry, it's a long video, but it was so much fun. So worth it. We got both of our holiday, we, our holiday binders done. We have one challenge done between both of them. Um, we have this one from um, um, Almost Organized Owl, Miss Nita. Thank you very much for this. And get our Christmas attire started. So, okay, guys. We are done. Thank you very much. I had the best time. Um, sorry I had to go so fast, but we got the darn thing done. And that's what matters, right? We saved for a cause. <laughs> All right, guys. Until the next time, I'm going to say please hit that like button. If you haven't done so already, if you've smiled even a little bit, hit that like button for me. And I will say be kind, be blessed. Be the reason someone smiles today, please. And my friends, I'll catch you on the flip side. Yes, I will. Bye.